back again. The Yashus Massif. Yes, we're X Teen going... AF. Yes, we're going to the Yak, the Yak, the Yakus Massif. The name of which is dumb. More like the anal. Graham, shut up. Shut up. Shut up. However, this world is not like the world of 10 AF that no one can <laughs> The world of 10 AF! Things have changed. Now well, that's perfectly reasonable. It's X Teen AF that isn't. Yes. But I just like the idea that, um, like, it'll be so weird and different and hamburgers will eat people. And it'll actually be exactly the same art resources as everything else, and it won't be different at all! Woo! Judging from the, like, picture of it, the preview picture, there's no, everything is dark all the time. Oh, that's nice. The sun is back in the sky. The eclipse is over. Or, it never existed in the first place. History here has changed. If the paradox didn't happen, then maybe Hope never had any reason to come here. There's still the Oracle Drive. Yeah, hope has not found its way into this video. What did you even hop on there? I don't know, but that's apparently an important item. Encounters gate seal. What? Sure. Yeah, sometimes he just sort of kicks off the scenery. You said that changing the future will also change the past. Which makes no fucking the sense. The eclipse doesn't happen because we solve the paradox in the future? Oh, I see. Solving the paradox stops the paradox from having happened. I understand that. Is... no, that doesn't fit. How can the future affect the past? But we actually do understand that now. I guess triangle? Because I now see how the future's affecting the past, because- I think square, because triangle is just- But isn't the future changing the past how it works? I guess, It's yeah. like, I have it upside down, I am a moron. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's square it then. You know, that Caius guy seems to know a lot about what's going on. Could he be the one who caused the paradox and the eclipse? No. He wants to protect the timeline, not change it. So, so he it's says. Trying to change history by yourself. This man. Have you met him before? It's not history. No. You've done nothing but go forwards. <laughs> he taught me how to fight. Except no, I guess. Time, a different place. The face and the name are the same. But You've said this before. He's using the gates, just like us. Yeah, but we we I didn't did ask it. Oh no, that was about Yule. The Caius I knew left us behind, took off on his own. That was how I lost you. See, he's just like Snow. He has an underage girlfriend too. Only his is genuinely underage. Like, not just underage, but I guess maybe theoretically could just look young, but no, sorry, she's actually 12. Yeah. <laughs> And that's cool as hell, brother. It's like that bit in Nathan Barley where he's like, yeah, just been sucked up. Guess how old? Guess how old? No, no, go younger. Younger. Now, nah, mate, illegal. Yeah, 13. Yeah. Nathan Barley's a good show, Thread. Watch it. For a given value of good. It's a fantastic show. Well, yeah, doesn't like it because it makes him uncomfortable. We got, got a man a monster. Uh, well, obviously, it was one of those. What does it do? Be do be do. It's, it's a commando. And it's got shit stats. It is, a, however, a late bloomer, which is funny to me because it's a plot. Area sweep. Yeah, fuck that. For a game of soldiers. And it has no basic passive, but it does have... Deal? No, oh, that's its thing. You are shit, go away. Why do people keep saying that to me? What was 
it looking for up in the sky? The future, maybe? Who knows? The future, maybe? No. No. Bad no. Okay, now you need to get up again. Okay. Oh, really, Emonies? Emonies? <laughs> So did they explain how we recruit monsters? Because like, in universe, they the time Moogle muttered something about it. Okay. Because Sarah has plot powers. Okay, that's all it. That's all I needed. I just couldn't remember whether they just sort of started joining us for for because. Which way are we actually supposed to be going? Oh, hey, it's actually the same map. Hmm. So we came from there. And over there is where we are theoretically going. Yeah, over there is where Hope was. Let's turn left, shall we? Yes. Like complete and utter morons who are going to have to go that way again anyway. Yes, yes. Turn left, Ben, no! Look at Ben a lot today. Sorry, what do you You're getting too used to doing so in Skype calls. Do I call you Ben in Skype calls now? As Maybe well? other people do. <laughs> Fair. That would be why then. Paper Ryan calls me Ben, I guess. Yeah, but that's just because he's on purpose retarded. Are we ever going to get worthwhile enemies again? <laughs> Define worthwhile, because I'm sure we're going to get some enemies that are too hard to fight. Too hard would be the opposite problem. Yeah, I don't think we're going to get a happy medium. Again the axe. Again. Coming this way was a Gandhi accident. I don't think we should have done it. <laughs> because all the balls are, are already get. And so, what do we the gain? The map says ball, but I don't even see empty ball. You know what? We were supposed to wait until now to come around and collect them, weren't we? Oh, did we go out of our way to get these ones? Because it was, um, full of bear moths. Oh, yeah! Okay, I know that in the game they're pronouncing it behemoth, but is behemoth actually a valid thing, or have I invented it somehow? I've always said behemoth, and so... It might be that I've also never heard it out loud, but like... I'm I've pretty sure I both. wouldn't have pronounced it that way without being told to. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I'm pretty sure I've heard both, and I think Behemoth is a very British way of saying it. So Behemoth is just Americans being stupid, okay. Not necessarily, it's Americans being different to us. I don't think the root of the word is... Yeah, but I think the root of the word is so steeped in time that a, a accurate pronunciation is probably hard to come by. I was going to say I don't think that the root of the word is really in English, but then I realised it probably is more so than anything else. Yeah, I don't know. Like, it's probably... Old Angle. Come, friends in the thread with language majors. Please help us with our... Behemoth problem. 
Like, sorry, I'll bam him. Problem. Now I'm doing it. Watch this go down too fast to be useful, but... Will this count as commando? Will what count yes, as commando? Yes, yes it did! What 100 did? fists works like commando. How do you mean? Oh, to the stagger gate? Yeah. Alright, cool. So it is a commando ability that just happens to be in the hands of a ravager. Oh hey, the thing got up and... Ah, uh, dicks for dinner! This is a sad reality. Oh god, Sarah's almost dead. Okay, she's fine. Because we can't really do anything while healing. Other than, I guess, let Millie do all the work. Also, Sarah and Noel, back the fuck up! Like, he's not attacking you, but you're just getting caught in the crossfire. That's stupid. And there should be a way to turn it off. This sucks. I'm glad Behemoth's Behemoths are still shit and I hate them. I'm glad that that's true. Because it's welcome familiarity, I guess. Yeah, exactly. Like, this is like coming home to an abusive father. <laughs> but it's a homecoming nevertheless. We're dead, aren't we? Yeah, we're dead. We're just gonna take a little while to admit it. Because if we raise, we won't cure enough health for him to not murder us with this way. Fuck you, Behemoths! I'll write it down in a I second. think we're supposed to be able to beat it now, though. Hmm. Have we just been over pumping attack? Yeah, I think we may start seeing the problems that arise from our leveling methods, which is cool as hell. Those boots. Welcome home. How did you? Yule. Did you come through the gate too? The one you met was a different Yule. A Yule from the future. What? Right. So, you don't know me either. I know about you. I've been watching you both. This is gonna get very confusing. Yeah. Future, like, no, 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 I'm Yule number seven. I can trace the timeline. I see the future and lead others along the correct path. I came here to confirm something. I just washed in with the Yule Tide. You and I are the same. What you Someone's mean? underage girlfriend. You too can show others the way. Wait. I don't get it. How are we the same? You seem plot important, and I'm certainly not. Despite theoretically being the main character. Yeah. It looks like Yule lives in this time too. No, are you okay? 
Yeah, it was just so unexpected. It threw me for a loop. Does Yule have a twin? Uh, I got it. <laughs> we are making Sarah so dumb. Aren't those time periods a little far apart? How could they be twins? Maybe one Don't of them encourage her, her no. Don't one of them, but only one of them. <laughs> I think you're trying too hard. I don't think we're trying hard enough to completely ruin the dialogue. We journeyed through time. Ruin being so a paradise. subjective term. And met two girls who looked exactly the same. And now, at last, we found our way back to Hope's Oracle Drive. He'll be waiting for us. Or perhaps he won't. In this timeline, he's black. This time, hope has forgotten us. All what time? You've come back to the same time, time to, to time, time, time. Except our yet past is your future is present, past, future, present, past, future, present, past, future. Have I ever mentioned how much I hate time travel stories? Everyone sensible hates time travel stories. I guess the ruins were interesting enough. They didn't need the paradox to draw them here. Like, the best use of time in stories is the stuff that doesn't pay too much attention. I'm with the Academy. I've been here for a while, researching the gates for the most part. There haven't been any reports of major paradox effects. However, the director ordered me to come here and investigate the area. The director being... Snow? In this timeline, Snow is the clever one. People don't seem to be very interested in this site. I don't know why the director thinks it's necessary for us to search this area right now, or ever. The director was analyzing the device known as the Oracle Drive when he predicted that an important event was going to take place here. Hello, I'm an important event. Convinced anything's going to happen. When the game, I've started investigating the ruins nearby. Ah, go away. I wonder if something happened to the gate. My baby's okay without me. <laughs> me too, lady. Me too. Alright, let's go talk to Hope isn't here. There's not gonna be anything to find. Sorry? There's not gonna be anything to find, is there? No. Balls are consistent across timelines. Just like my balls. Except in the Omega timeline, my balls are purple. <laughs> ah, Sarah took a shortcut, and that looked hilarious. Everything is right on schedule, as usual. You're the same person, but you moved. What? Did I miss something? Chocobocalina! I feel like I'm forgetting. What does she think so about the fact that she's now in a different this time? Line. Time for my feathers to soak up some of that good old vitamin D for extra fluff. Hate you. Chocobocalina. Sorry, didn't see you there. Hate you. We can make the ones that get extra chain bonus. No. Like, I would like to see a game with a time plot that does dick moves like, well, in this timeline you never upgraded your weapons. I think that would be funny. But I don't want to play it. <laughs> I just want to know that it exists. Thank if Triace were left to their own devices to make a time travel game. Yes. I think it's time to hit the beach, don't you? I hate you! I hope my baby's okay without me. Even though last time we spoke to you, you referred to Noel and Sarah as you and you, which is funny. It's uh, you and you. Hey there, you and you! <laughs> People don't seem to be very interested in this site. Because nothing's happened here. The Academy is putting so much effort into resolving. 
<laughs> that was a good voice actor who I enjoyed. You seemed anxious about something. So many NPCs. Yep. You could just throw the chocobo at the wall mm -hmm. and the Moogle. Moogle and just see if anyone important runs at you. He bounces exactly twice. <laughs> Director, who are you waiting for? I don't know. <laughs> I was reading the dialogue at the bottom and genuinely expected Alyssa to go Kukumo Kupo because you threw Mog at the right time. She's like, Director, who are you waiting for? Kupo Kupo. In a world where the paradox was solved, the eclipse never darkened the sky in the first place. No one remembered that Noel and I had been here. But, even so, Hope was there, waiting for us. Because... Of course, his memories had changed. We had our ten-year reunion all over again, as if our last meeting had never happened. So let's watch it again from when scratch. When oh. his memories had changed because the paradox had been dissolved, Hope believed us without question. <laughs> because Hope's a little bit dumb. And then... And useless, and can't think for himself. A dramatic rescue of Boomerang. I have something I want to show you. Yes. Yeah, that's the thing. He didn't need to join us in a fight this time. What the shit? Oh, it's Lightning's fight again. Except there's He's more like horses me. this time, I swear. This is a recording of the future. And this we're is a recording of the future, he says without there irony. There is one thing we're sure about, however. And remember, we don't know what era this is. It's the future, though. Lightning is alive in that place. In my memory, Lightning disappeared after the battle with Orphan. But she's living somewhere in the future. <laughs> so it's not just a dream, is it? We've established pretty much that Why it is you a dream. I'm going to find her. Using I'm present to tense future, to sir. talk about the future. After all, you traveled through time and found me. <laughs> Many years of research have finally borne fruit. It all began with the Oracle Drive. We excavated it from ruins many centuries old. Yet it recorded an image of Cocoon. Alyssa, what are you doing? It was an impossibility. <laughs> Why do they think we care about Alyssa so much? This is when I learned what I must do. If it was possible to journey through time and look into the future. Mog. I mog him in this scene. It must also be possible to travel backwards and change the past. Right. I wanted to change history, make things better, not just bring lightning back, but Vanille and Fang. That wouldn't my mother. make better. Yeah, that's probably a bad so idea. That's what your research was about. And he is still driven by the death of Nora. <laughs> yes, he is. But you've made me realize something. None of this makes sense, so I may as well wing it. It's just like old time. History. The past has already been changed. Did I tell you about the time that we stopped being Seath because of friendship or something? The fall of Cocoon. Director! Director, there's a boss battle incoming. How many? <laughs> How many times are they gonna show us this battle? Um, so Caius made Cocoon go. fall. <laughs> Caius. What happened? Did the prophecy get rewritten? Not necessarily rewritten. It could be the original prophecy restored as it once was. What? Perhaps a continuation of time. The if this is showing us the future. And someday, Cocoon will fall. In this timeline. 
You told me in your time, Cocoon didn't exist like it does now. Yeah. It came to ground long before I was born. After it happened, the whole world just fell apart, pretty much. But who made it fall? Could it have been Caius? No. He couldn't do that. We just saw him do it, dude. supposed to fall. How many years? Is it soon? No. I hate you. Not for a couple of centuries. Oh, that's a long time from now. I mean, none of us will even be alive to see it. Unless we go time traveling. Others will. <laughs> Cocoon will fall into Grand Pulse. Imagine the catastrophe. Think how many lives will be destroyed. Right. Suffer, panic, that's panic! The future I lived in. It doesn't have to happen. No, we can change the future. Mm. And in changing the future, change the past. The past, place. present, future, yeah. past, present, future, yeah. your present, our past. You the future the of this world in a separate timeline. Do you even have a gate to take you there? Well, we... It might not be necessary to travel to this specific time and place. <laughs> How so? The future depends Just on what we do go now, right? Somewhere yes, close there is a chance cocoon will fall. Also we can start near to the time of white. Yeah. Right. Past, but present, future, present, future, past, present. We can at least work to mitigate the damage. If we begin our research now, we have time. Then, should cocoon indeed fall, we can help protect the planet and save the victims. Okay. Uh, let's do it. We could try to solve things at the other end in the future. <laughs> While you start preparing you know what the worst now. thing about this time travel plot is? Yes, let's change All of the it, there's multiple kinds of time fuckery going on. Yeah, yeah, that's the problem. If you change the future, you change the past. Sarah? What the fuck is it's any of this? Nothing. Hope. Thank you for the help. It's not like, underexplained like the first one, oh, it's just stupid. Go. Yeah, yeah, that's the, like... <laughs> It's past. so much the better, history drove him forward. but it's still but now, awful to face the future. in new and exciting the ways. It's like ten past. steps forward and seven so, back. Yeah. Do you believe too? It's like Do trying to trace the past? Legend of Zelda game's timeline, but all enclosed in one game. We tried so hard to save the pillar, together with Snow. Was it all in vain? Yes. It was bound to collapse over time. There was no stopping it. But why did Caius interfere? You know, what's Caius's deal? He's just a dick. So it was bound. Mm -hmm. 